Hello and welcome to my channel, Billboard's Builds. I'm I'm Chet, aka Billboard. If you're uh, new to the channel, please subscribe. If you're a returning viewer, thank you. Make sure you hit the thumbs up like a hitchhiker. Like and subscribe to, to this channel. Uh, leave me a comment if you will. Uh, first off, I want to give a shout out to uh, Marcus over at Hot Rods Model Shop with a Z. Go check out his channel. He wrote me a nice thing on the back. Um, so uh, I want to show you a few things and give you a little uh, update. I just uh, finished painting the uh, coronet. I have two different hoods I did. This one's got a little blemish over there where the tape peeled off uh, a little of the paint. Um, and then this is the... The one with the home with the scoop I made. That's where I am with the coronet. Uh, now let's go to the bench. Okay, here we are at the bench. Here are my uh, Iceman collections, um, Dukes of Hazard figures. I made a, a handcrafted uh, bases for each figure because not all of them stand on their own. Daisy doesn't stand on her own, and I think Poe. So here's Daisy. The facial features and the eyes I had the most trouble with. There's Uncle Jesse. Here's Luke. Little focus. His face, his eyes look like clowns. Roscoe P. Coltrane. Cooter. There's Bo. Here's Boss Hog. There's a couple of uh, American Diorama. Figures I got. I also painted a bunch of spoons. I didn't do a good job painting them, but that's cream colored. That's chroma gray. That's wicked gray from Createx. The cream it cream's from Createx. That's from Chroma Air. That's uh, that's from uh, Createx. This is Wicked Charcoal. And this is Payne's Gray, which looks black to me. Those are the colors I'm picking from for the interior on my Porsche build. And for the exterior, I... I chose two colors to try out. This is blue silver Createx or Wicked made by Createx. That's just on gray primer. This is the blue silver which I did not uh, prep the spoon so that's why it looks so terrible. I think I over I let the paint get too much at one time. But that's over Autoborn Auto Silver Sealer. And then this is 
Midnight Blue over Gray Primer. And this is Wicked Blue, uh, not Wicked, uh, Wicked Midnight Blue over Auto Born Sealer. <clears throat> My wife thinks I should go with that for the interior and that for the exterior. What I might do is do the seat backs in charcoal, the dashboard in charcoal, the uh, carpeting or the floor, and the uh, in, uh, front sides of the seats where you would sit in uh, this gray. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Now, a couple of uh, stash ads to show you. Nineteen AMT, nineteen sixty six Chevy Nova Pro Street. Comes with an engine stand, an extra engine block. Uh, wide slicks, tubed chassis. Looks like it's be a good uh, kit to make a custom drag car out of. That's that. And then there's this. 1968 Shelby GT500. It's a fastback. Um, it's got a big block in it. Wide tires. What I'm thinking about with this kit is making a tribute to the uh, 00, the only car that ever beat the General Lee. Um, that was in the uh, Reunion movie. It was a uh, 68 Ford uh, Mustang Fastback. And it was blue with the uh, flames coming off the front. I might do that with this. That or make maybe a bullet car or just do it as a the Shelby GT500 the way it is. Um, you could uh, let me know what you think in the... Uh, in the uh, comments that was just a little quick update on my uh my what i've done on the bench shout out to marcus and i've been doing a lot of painting this week with those figures were kicking my behind um uh, never feel so blind as when you try to paint a 124 scale face uh and then i didn't like uh, how some of the uh flesh tones were looking because they don't look anything like they do in the bottle when they dry. So, till next time, we gone. Bye-bye.